What is happening in in, 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 in with the millions <laughs> and millions of J-Rock fans from all over the world? Oh, you're right here with J-Rock, and last night, baby, oh, that young man, Dame Dollar, Damian Lillard, Dame Time. Last night, that dude went off. Oh, and he went off. For the good old 61, baby. 61 last night. I think that tied his career high. My man, Damian Lillard, said, y'all got to put some respect on my name. Oh, and last night, he damn sure demanded it. And I think he got it. If he didn't have it already. He had my respect. This ain't stealth. But still got my respect. Why don't we take a look back at this epic box office performance from Dame Dollar. Yeah, the numbers don't show it. He's going to be an outstanding three-point shooter. I think so, and, and that's probably what scares the oh, heck out of me. all of the around. NBA no coaches. Mind. Carmelo winning that individual matchup of the former New York Knicks teammates. Collins using the size. Zach Collins with six points. Hassan is wired to help on the drives, get situated for the shot block. Right. Is able to sneak behind Dame. He gets the respect from everybody, so it's gonna be a team effort. Porzingis with 16. Dame ah. tries to draw the foul, but gets the three to pop. Ain't been in one on that. Trey him, Trey him. It stops. Now you lean in. That's the hit. Blazers still in control. Just under seven left to go in this first half. Dame, he's got 12. No, he wants more. Dame rattles in the three. Big roll, so you can pressure up. But tram, you don't tram. want to pressure ah. up. Showing you the lateral ability to stay in front. Dame gets Porzingis wow. once again and hits the turbo button. Man, that's a lot of separation on that drive. Damien exploding along this baseline. Oh, Porzingis can't stay in front of him. Action should come back toward him. Barbecue chicken. I'd love right to there. see him get Porzingis involved again, and he does. Dame able Step to back regain on. control. And Damian Lillard on a roll here in this first half is officially losing. So the opportunity is there for the Blazers. Dame working through a forest of Maverick uh. defenders. Right hand on the left side of the glass once again. Dame's got 25. Maverick's only answer on this action right now is to blitz it or double team it and, and well, rotate early me. because what they're doing by dropping Porzingis, they're allowing Damian to dictate the turn. Skips one over to Burke. Burke will try a second three-pointer. Mello pats it up top and Gary Trent Jr. comes down with it. No tram, Dang, tram. He'll get a look at ah. three. So the Blazers get another three to fall. I don't target though, but it was off a similar setup. Here's the hit ahead pass from Gary. CJ on that right. CJ McCollum. back man. down for the Blazers. Off of five, man, 845 left. Dame with yet another Broken three. Back. This man is danger. Lamar. He drops back, concedes the three to Dame. Ah. Screen in transition. This dude. This I don't mind the trading of threes for twos if the Blazers. Can get hot been here. Back Dame with 31. Dame, why not mode. do it again? Damian Lillard, paint it. Straight Jr. Whiteside and Hazonia. Mello gets it to Dame. Dame, back to Mello. Mello train him up. And train that three train falls for Mello. The Blazers tie it up. Blazers still looking for that elusive field goal of this quarter. Damian Lillard would love for it to be a three-pointer, and Dame answers the call. Lillard, one more look at the three from Damian Lillard. Well, you got the feeling early on in this one that he was headed around that that number, shatter records. And right now, his scoring average of 29.3, that's a franchise record in the single season. Clyde Drexler right. was second with 27.2. Carmelo swarming around Doncic, and it looked like CJ got into that shot a little reluctantly. Dame works all the way him. around for Zingas and some spinning. 53 on the game for Dame. Chicken right there. Gets Kleba switched out to him. Uh -oh. Point mess. guards are just going back and forth in this one. Dang, step back, step back three, yeah. ties it up with the splash. Mello working against Doncic, gets it back to Dame, six to shoot. Oh, one Four right to here. shoot, Tram, team three Tram. for Damian Lillard. 
Oh. And that Whoa. falls in for Damian Lillard. 61 <laughs> points on the ricochet. Dingus blazer ball. Well, look at how high this thing bounces. It, it left the frame. Dude, cut saying cut the two and it came back down. Eight seed up for grabs for the Blazers. Donches trying to defend Dame. Dame gets to the paint. Bounce pass. Hassan Whiteside with the chance. Last night, it was Dame. Ty. I think that J Rock says the Blazers didn't score a basket. The whole fourth quarter until Dame Lillard stepped on the court. I think they went almost like almost three minutes without scoring a basket. Now apparently CJ McCollum he broke his back. He has like some sort of micro fracture in his back. Take it from uh, personal experience. You don't want to mess with the back. If that back go, you done, but you ain't going nowhere doing nothing. Take care of your back. Okay? But J Rock says this. That was incredible by Dane Dollars. I guess he, he heard all the chirping from Skip Bayless on Undisputed. How Skip is saying, You're not a superstar, brother. Because while you do it, get it done in the regular season, come postseason, it ain't Dane time. And I guess hitting two game winning uh, series clinching shots ain't good enough right now i will say this it is amazing to jay rock that steph curry is 10 and 0 in the playoffs against that guy dame lillard 10 and 0 damian lillard has not won a game against the warriors in which steph curry has played in hasn't won a game and before everybody goes, well, you know, KD this, KD that. And all of the games that Steph Curry has played in against the Blazers, Kevin Durant has played in one game. One. Do you smell what the rock now, they blew him out that game because that was a game four of the 2017 uh, first round. They just blew him out. But the rest of those games, KD wasn't out there. So, Dame... Well, I think what Skip's saying is a little bit too far. Uh, he has a small point. And believe me when I say it's small. Dame Lillard is big time. Dame Lillard is clutch. Dame Lillard got that Dame time. You know what time it is. Brum man step up. Now, he doesn't make every shot. Nobody does. But he is still big time. And this Thursday night, I will be watching against the Nets, depending on who's going to play for the Nets. Uh, but they got to win that game. If they win that game, they, they get the eight seed. And it'll probably be them against that damn Devin Booker and the Phoenix Suns, who are 7-0 and in the bubble. 7-0. and Devin Booker averages 30-plus. And they, they are undefeated. That's going to be a hell of a uh, play-in right there. The damn uh, Blazers against the Suns. Dame against Devin. Oh, my God. That's going to be must-see TV, baby. You know those dudes going to go at it. It's going to be like, and, and, and don't mess around and let the Phoenix win one game. Because the nine seed, the ninth seed you got to beat the eight seed twice. The eight seed only has to be the ninth seed once. So if, if Phoenix somehow wins the first game and then it comes down to all the marbles, one game, you know these dudes are going to be letting it fly. And I'm going to be right there watching, just like this. Just like that. But uh, J-Rock says this. The bubble has uh, a lot of strange things that happen in the bubble. You got T.J. Warren looking like the second coming of James Harden. You got the, the, the Phoenix Suns, or 7-0. and You you got uh, Damian Lillard uh, doing the damn thing. Uh, you got the damn Clippers, can't beat the Nets. You got the Lakers looking like a non-playoff team. What the hell is going on in this bubble, man? There's a lot going on right now. I got Giannis winning the MVP. 
I just think that, you know, while LeBron has had an amazing uh, season, you can't have a, you have a tag team partner in AD who's leading the team in points, rebounds, steals, and blocks. And, but the other guys are MVP to lead. Like, no. That just can't happen. All right? But I do think that Giannis is going to win back-to-back. Uh, I think Chris Paul should have gotten more praise and more respect because if people talk about LeBron and, you know, narrative, same same thing applies with Chris Paul. People thought he was done, he was finished because of what happened at the end of that Houston series against Golden State. People didn't even think he was going to be on the team in OKC when the season started. And lo and behold, they won the top seeds in the West. So you damn sure got to put some respect on Chris Paul's name right there. But... Uh, I had to react to this because Dame just went off last night. Went off. And so, um, I'm staying tuned. What's going to happen next in the damn bubble? Because I want to see the damn Bla- uh, Blazers against the Suns. Booker against Dame time. Uh, Devin Buckets against Dame time. I got to see this, man. Post your comments down below and let J-Rock know what you thought of Dame time's game last night. And if you appreciate it and enjoy it, J-Rock's reacts to this. Hit that like button, subscribe, and share. Join the great one on this electrifying journey to 1 million subscribers. Any video request, reaction request, put it on my people's Facebook fan page. Or you can just put it in the comment section below. And uh, if I have time, I'll check it out there. Lastly, hit that bell so you can be notified that it is time to be electrified. Thank you for joining J-Rock. Until we meet again. Mamba and Gigi forever. Love your smell. What J Rock is.